Elon Musk buys Twitter for approximately $44 billion. Twitter's board of directors unanimously agreed to Musk's offer to purchase the social media platform at a price of $44 billion, the company announced Monday. Musk, a prolific Twitter user, has repeatedly decried efforts to moderate speech on the service. Free speech is the bedrock of a functioning democracy, and Twitter is the digital town square where matters vital to the future of humanity are debated, Musk said in a statement posted to Twitter. I also want to make Twitter better than ever by enhancing the product with new features, making the algorithms open source to increase trust, defeating the spam bots, and authenticating all humans. It's a 38% premium to Twitter's closing stock price on April 1st, the last trading day before Musk disclosed his approximately 9% stake in Twitter. The Twitter board conducted a thoughtful and comprehensive process to assess Elon's proposal with a deliberate focus on value, certainty, and financing, said Twitter board chair Brett Taylor in a statement. It was first revealed in early April that Musk had acquired a 9% stake in Twitter, making him one of the company's biggest shareholders. Since then, Musk and the company had engaged in something of a corporate battle over the future of the company, with Musk briefly agreeing to join the board, later announcing an acquisition offer, and Twitter looking to stop Musk's acquisition with a corporate maneuver known as a poison pill, which is meant to block takeover efforts. The poison pill was seen as a stopgap measure to prevent Musk from purchasing the social media platform. The pill, known as a shareholder rights plan, would have prevented Musk from purchasing more than 15% of Twitter shares on the open market by triggering a provision to allow Twitter to sell more shares, diluting the value of Musk's holdings. Twitter shares had lost some 17% of their value between the time current CEO Parag Agrawal was announced as the social media platform's newest chief and April 14, when Musk revealed his outsized ownership stake. Lowry Bruner, senior portfolio manager for financial services group Thrivent's large cap growth fund, which holds about $160 million worth of Twitter shares, told NBC that given his record at Tesla, Musk would be able to serve as a catalyst for delivering strong performance at Twitter. Do not allow Twitter to become a petri dish for hate speech, or falsehoods that subvert our democracy, Johnson said in part. Jason Abertseze is the senior editor for technology, science and climate for NBC News Digital.